Hello guys, welcome to online web tutor presented by Profotic Solutions team. I am Sanjay. We are learning WordPress with jQuery UI tutorial for beginners and this is our part 8. In this video session guys, we will see that how can we implement draggable feature of jQuery UI in WordPress. And all of our existing code guys, we have uploaded into this GitHub link. And also, if you are a beginner to this channel guys, then please don't forget to subscribe and keep watching our previous video sessions to get the clear concept about part number 8. So basically guys, so far what we have completed in this playlist. So if you go to administrator panel, this is the menu section means this is the plugin that we have developed in this playlist. So in, by the help of this plugin, we actually understand about that what is or how can we implement accordion, autocomplete, date picker, dialog, tabs and tooltip. So these are all features of jQuery we have implemented in WordPress. Okay, so next feature is that how can we implement draggable feature of jQuery UI in our WordPress setup. Okay, so if I click that, this is the draggable section. So basically a draggable section, what is a draggable feature in jQuery? So according to the jQuery documentation, you can study that allow elements to move using the mouse. Means when just I am going to click on this link and if we scroll, then as we can see that we are successfully drag these features. This is simply a div element. Okay, so if we go to the view source, this is the div section that we have made and this is the id okay so by the help of this id we have implemented a method called draggable this is jquery method okay so by the help of this method we attach this method with this id okay so it gets draggable right here okay so we want to implement this feature in our wordpress setup so just back to editor so this is the plugin so far that we have developed and all, all of the code of this plugin we have uploaded to this github link. Okay, so just back to editor. First of all, let's make a submenu page for our draggable feature. Okay, so let's say that add submenu page, it's draggable. Okay, so just copy this draggable, paste it here. We want to change the next, that is something called the slug. Okay, so this is a menu slug. So instead of tooltip, let's say that draggable okay next we have to change the callback function okay so instead of this tooltip callback function let's get rid of that and let's say draggable okay so we have to define this callback function so let's copy that let's say function this is the function name and now inside this function we are going to call a php file and in that php file we will code all of our draggable okay so let's make a file inside this views folder okay so just i'm going to create a php file let's say draggable so just get rid of that go to jquery ui documentation go to view source section let's copy all these things okay so if i copy that go to editor and paste here okay so just back to ui panel and let's call this file inside this callback function okay so let's say ob start we are going to call uh, by the help of php buffer okay so ob and clean this is the cleaning action of buffer so let's include the template this is the template that we have made for the draggable section okay so just i'm going to copy include once include once this is the jquery wp path it is a constant that we have made okay so basically this is the constant which contains the directory path up to this plugins folder okay so inside this plugins folder we have to go inside this views folder okay so views folder contains our draggable.php file okay so instead of ta tooltip let's say draggable dot php file okay so successfully we have included that file we have to read all the contents of this draggable so let's store all the contents inside this template variable so ob get contains this is the php function needs to read all the contents from that and finally we have to just echo that so let's say echo template okay so if i save this file go to browser reload this page so once we hover on this plugin, this is the option that we have added draggable. So if I click on that, this is the option that we have added drag me around. Okay. So now it's not working because we have not implemented the draggable feature or we haven't used the jQuery UI library file for that. Okay. So just go to jQuery UI. Now we have implemented this deep section. Next we have to use this draggable function. So how can we use that? So just copy this. Go to JavaScript J means skip.js file. Let's me paste here. Okay, so instead of dollar, let's say jQuery. So if I save this file, just inspect here. Okay, go to console. Let's refresh this page. 
So here we can see that we have an error called draggable is not a function. Basically, we have used this function. Okay. So for definition section of this function, we have included a file called jQueryUI.js. Okay. So how can we use this file? So basically, WordPress provides a library for that. So just scroll down or let's search for draggable. Okay. So we need to include this parameter or we need to pass this parameter inside the function called WP in QScript to use the feature of draggable. Okay. So just I'm going to copy copy this go to editor and let's include this file inside this JS function that we have made and this is here okay so let's say WP in script all we have to pass this parameter as here okay so this is jQuery UI draggable and basically guys this is dependent on jQuery library okay so we need to include jQuery also okay so these are the default features guys that we have used to use the draggable feature of jQuery UI so just save this file now this is the thing that we have attached this method actually has been called by the help of this library file okay so if i save this file go to administrator panel reload your page and now error has gone so just i'm going to click and drag this div and as we can see that successfully we are going to drag this div so just back to editor let's make some of the more divs to this section so instead of id let's say class okay so just copy this paste it here paste it here and paste it here okay so we have made let's around part one okay so just I'm going to copy paste here this is part two paste here let's say part three paste here let's say part four okay so successfully we have made four deep section by the help of a class called draggable okay so only we want to change instead of this ID let's say class Okay, so just back to browser, reload this page. We have four deep section and one of the paragraph has not been actually closed successfully. So let's say that p tag. Okay, so if I save this, paste it here, and now we can drag any of the div inside this area. Okay, so let's refresh that. Let's make a proper format of this div. So let's say that this is the draggable. Let's add some of the CSS section for this. So let's say that height equal to 40 pixel let's say border radius or border let's say one pixel solid and it should be black okay and let's say that also we want to be margin top let's say four pixel and also we want some padding let's say something called 5 pixel and also we want that okay everything is fine now so just I'm going to copy this CSS go to editor and let's paste right here okay so let's say style this is the CSS that we did just save this file close this inspect and refresh this page okay this is not appearing let me check that so back to editor and here we have implemented draggable okay so it's not just get rid of this UI draggable handler and it's here okay so this is the class that we have made and this is the CSS for that okay so if we save this refresh this page this is the CSS that we have applied okay so let's me drag drop drag drop drag drop so all of the features of draggable we have successfully implemented in WordPress okay so just go to its documentation and here is one of the option called revert position okay so inside this revert as we can see that inside this draggable method we have a object property called revert equal to true okay so just I'm going to copy go to script.js and pass right here okay so if we save this go to administrator panel reload this page so once we drag as we can see that it is revert back to its original position this is why because we have passed the revert property inside that object so successfully guys we have seen that how can we implement draggable feature of jquery ui in wordpress so basic steps that we have to actually remember to use this is that we need to use the library called jquery ui draggable okay by using this we can actually use this draggable method okay and all of the draggable feature and all we have passed revert equal to true it means that it regains the same position or the original position after dragging that 
ओके सो बाय द हेल्प ऑफ दिस वीडियो सेशन गाइस वी एक्चुअली अंडरस्टैंड दैट हाउ कैन वी इंप्लीमेंट ड्रैगेबल ऑफ जेक्वरी यूआई इन वर्डप्रेस सो इफ यू हैव एनी डाउट इन दिस वीडियो सेशन गाइस देन प्लीज ड्रॉप योर कमेंट आई विल गिव माय रिप्लाई एज सुन एज पॉसिबल सो फॉर दिस वीडियो सेशन गाइस थैंक यू फॉर वाचिंग हैव अ ग्रेट डे